I am going to talk to you about a startup now that I've been building for about a year now called Remix. And the title of my talk is Beyond the Hype. The reason I called it Beyond the Hype is last year there was a lot of hype and a lot of press coverage over NFTs and they became synonymous with financial instruments that people were trading like stocks. However, that overshadowed the utility and technology behind NFTs. And I'll be speaking to you about how creators and brands are using a remix to create new monetization strategies for their businesses, building communities, and creating unique experiences. Then 2007, the iPhone launched. And when the iPhone launched, all of the focus was on the camera, as opposed to the Blackberry, where all the focus is on email. So as soon as we saw the iPhone launch and it started growing exponentially, and since all the focus is on the camera, obviously the number of mobile photographs were going to grow exponentially as well. So we figured people are going to want to do uh, things with those mobile photographs and create physical products. So keep in mind, this is back in 2008, so it was pretty novel. Um, so we launched a sister site called canvaspop.com to allow anyone to take your mobile photographs and have it printed as large pieces of art. That company, or that sister site, took our revenues from 1 million to 1.8, to 3.6, to 5, to 7, to 8. I finally got that company to 15 million in revenue, but more important than 15 million in revenue, highly profitable 15 million in revenue. We started building communities. So we obviously had a big photography community, both with mobile and um, uh, professional photographers. But then we started building applications across different verticals. So we built a gaming application for several video games where users of those video games can create personalized art based on content of the video games that they play. And that started opening up an entire gaming community that we're using Canvas Pop as their main provider for printing. Uh, we also created a tech and art community as well, where we invited creative coders to talk about how they used AI to create generative art applications and we had an entire community of art and tech coders that were using our services as well. So this is one of our artists, his name is Sabit, he's based in Los Angeles. Uh, he has a global following um, and he sells out of in every NFT project he ever drops because he's got a, just a great community that he's built.